Good morning, everyone. How are you doing today? Um, this is Cheryl Stark, and this is my latest um, my latest uh, journal share with you. I've created um, a portfolio box to hold a journal, as I did with the previous two journals I've made. This time, I got a little mixed media on it. I uh, embossed the paper I used to mat it. I distressed stained it with four different distress stains and then I painted it with a metallic paint uh, to give it kind of like a patina if you will so uh, this is what it looks like when it's opened up and the journal is on the inside here This is a journal I've made with, um, it's a fabric covered journal. It's about six, six by, f six and a half by five. Um, it's got a seam binding closure, oatmeal seam binding. Um, uh, have a book plate on the front, which is made with a die cut that, a die that I have. And, uh, it's ottoman themed. I've used, I've used, um, Artie Mays' Autumn Splendor Papers. So let's take a look. On the inside, I have a pocket that I made with embossed papers and, and um, paper from the, from the kit. This is a traveler's notebook style. Um, I've got a couple of inserts here made with um, envelopes and such. Um, used uh, the papers. There are top loading pockets in each of these uh, each of these envelopes. There's a front po uh, there's a pocket in the in the first page with the mason jar and a couple of tags that I put together with a brad and an embossed tag. Got a little quote from Vincent Van Gogh down here that came off a, a, a tea tag. If you truly love nature, you will find beauty everywhere. It's got tea stained papers that I've sewn a little into the signatures. It's got a pocket from the collection, some tags that I've made from the collection, a couple little hand sewn pads and another tag that's been decorated with a brad and um, some leaf trim. The tags are made out of 100, 100 pound cardstock. Here's a little corner tuck with a t ticket in it. Another embossed tag. Another tag I made from the papers. And a little journaling spot here. This one has a side loading pocket with a couple of cards and a um, from the collection. Here's another ticket from the collection. I made a little journaling card out of leftover paper and I stamped and stenciled this one for a little top tuck spot. This is a little envelope I've made. I really love this embossing and um, this embossing technique with a with a distress stain and the metallic paint. It's just it gives it such a a depth of of color and texture and look that is just um, wonderful. A couple more inserts, little corner doily tuck there that I've made with my die cuts couple of tags some more tea stained papers there's quite a bit of writing space in these made I wanted to make this um, 
traveler's notebook type um, a little bit more personal in size another tag that is embossed this is an envelope from the collection papers from the collection are so gorgeous Another top tuck spot with some tags I made from the papers. A little file folder from the collection. This is a little folder card that you can use for decoration or Didn't want to waste a bit of it. Some more tea stain papers. Little bottom tuck spot with a few tickets in it. Te uh, journaling card from the collection I um, stamped on with my new stamps. And some more tags. Got a little cheesecloth on the bottom here, trim and some eyelash trim and little leaf trim that I found at um, Dollar Tree. I love this page so much, I just cut left it blank uh, for somebody to. Uh, either journal on or put a picture on it make a beautiful backdrop for a picture got a little bit of um, ribbon here that uh, it was wire edged ribbon I just took the wire out and made a pocket out of it some more tags I made from the paper collection with some great trim on the top another little envelope with a card inside Sorry, didn't mean to bump the camera. Made this little ticket a fold out in a pocket. And some more papers. I cut some ticket tags from the collection. Pocket I made from the papers and a tag, a big tag, large tag. I just made a little collage here. Like I say, we have tags that pull out. All the tabs have tags on them. A corner tuck spot. little uh, collage decoration here with a leaf and a couple of journaling cards in this corner tuck spot another bottom tuck I made a tag from the papers a glassine bag here which I've decorated up with some cheesecloth and eyelash trim and a ticket from the collection and a couple of journaling cards inside And another pocket with the mason jar inside. A couple more tags I made from the kit. And another envelope here with a card inside. And the last page I left blank. Put just a little bit of trim on it. Well, I hope you all like it, this sweet little journal. Um, Autumn Splendor by Artie Mays. Um, please like and subscribe and comment and tell me what you think. Um, you can get in touch with me either on Junk Journal Junkies Boutique 
or on my fa on the Facebook or message me on Facebook if you're interested in this book at all. I hope you all have a great day. I'll be back on with my next um, my next video. I'm going to have a tutorial on on how to do these boxes. Um, it's similar to the grungy envelope uh, portfolio, other than adding um, adding a, a large gusset at the bottom and at the top to and a and kind of like a strap to uh, hold the journal in. Uh, I think it makes a, a, a great accompaniment to the journal. It fits inside nicely. With a policy envelope type closure. There you have it. I hope you all have a great day.